Every day is worth celebrating. And today we're getting jiggy with it with you. Welcome to True Holidays. Yes, we are the Saturday holiday show people who meet and talk <laughs> about Saturday holidays. And so today we want to talk about those holidays. Hopefully you can talk to us back and tell us about your experience with these holidays. Do it. And have a yeah. feast of holidays. knowledge. Yeah, just people are going to wonder, how did you know today was that day? Every day is worth celebrating. So yeah, today... Uh, National Cheese Sacrifice Day. That's right. You got it. Oh, it's Sacrifice Purchase Day. Oh, okay. So first you have to buy it. Cheese Sacrifice I, I didn't, Purchase Day. I didn't know that was part of the holiday. Well. That you actually, because I don't buy cheese. So now what I have to do is buy cheese and then sacrifice it. Yeah. Hmm. Well, and here you go. If you wish to catch some mice, first some cheese you must sacrifice. So, purchase the cheese upon this day, and a mouse-free house is here to stay. Makes yep. sense. All you mices, you can, you can have my cheese. I don't want it. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, it's also International Tiger Day. I don't think that's Tiger Woods. I don't think they'd make a holiday for him just yet. No, especially because the link is to the UN. <laughs> Maybe he's that big. <laughs> Is he extinct? Were they trying to save from... Uh, yeah. <laughs> people from hunting Tiger Woods? Maybe you should be playing baseball. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's also uh, National Lasagna Day. I love lasagna. Yeah. yeah I'm not you? A, no. No. It's too much cheese. I'm going to sacrifice my well, lasagna, there you go. too. Two for... I'll eat the lasagna. You can give him the cheese. Sacrifice oh. it. Okay. I'm, you think mice will eat it? I know cats do. But Garfield. Garfield. <laughs> he does. But okay. Yeah, and uh, of course it's uh, National Chicken Wing Dan. Uh, chicken Wing Day. It's chicken Wing Dan. Chicken Wing Dan. Grab your day. Chicken Wing Dan. Yeah, there you go. Celebrated annually on July 29th. Okay. That's right. Glad that that's a... Yeah, and there's your chicken wing life. history. The history of the chicken wings. If you didn't know chickens had wings, well, then there you go. <laughs> so, yeah. And what else we got, man? Well, today is also National Dance Day. Yeah. And, and why that's so special to us is because we've... I mean, our, our lives are basically ran around dance between our... My wife and our daughters. Yeah, daughters and man, We've it's a whole life of uh -huh. attending dances. And now they teach, and yeah, it's it's crazy. It's a part they're of so our good. Lives. I mean, they got trophies and they've won so many things. It's it's amazing, and they are amazing dancers. And, the, and they're known within their communities mm -hmm. as well. I mean, it's it's not just us that talk about them. There's there's people outside yeah. here that that love what they do and appreciate their dance because they're good at it. So you yeah. would think because of their expertise that maybe it would sneeze onto us a little bit. Maybe should have rubbed off on a us. Little, but a little bit. It didn't. I don't even know if they would teach us to dance. I've never really asked them. I think we'd embarrass them a little bit more than anything, <laughs> honestly. So we, instead of trying to learn from them, um, we found this website called SucceedSocially.com. And it's how to dance for average guys and girls. So you don't have to be born with it, and you don't have to have the skill rubbed off on you. But this website takes you step by step. Things not only to think about, but how to dance as well. Because Sweet. that first step is getting over the fear of, what is everybody thinking about me? That's if, what I do. Once you get over yeah. that, then the rest is easier. Yeah. I mean, for guys, I mean, your typical... Guy dancer wants to be better than the other dudes on the dance floor. <laughs> I mean, you're they're peacocking, trying to yeah. do all those pop blocking and gymnastic flips. I mean, that's the I, the best ideal guy dancer you can. Because they of. yeah, because they've seen all the movies. I guess uh -huh. this they this will ruined it for us. This will bring them in. <laughs> I'm gonna get all the ladies. So yeah. keep yeah. with keeping that in mind. Women guys are just pleased if they can dance with you. So. 
don't worry about what the guy thinks, what you look like. Yeah. Yeah. Just tap your foot and let us stand by you. Yep, we're good. <laughs> we're going to go home that night and be as happy as can be. And we're yeah. going to tell all our friends about how awesome we were, even if we weren't, and that we got to dance with a girl. Yeah. So, I mean, that's, that's the start of this website. I mean, you go down, though, and it, it gives you more dancing cores and, and different things to do. But at down, we would found a hidden link. I was hoping I can get to it, but uh, I, I'm not going to get to it right now. But I, I was hoping we could find that, download it, and then maybe we could learn learn to dance together. Maybe we can be yeah. a little better. And the, by the recording, yeah. Have All you, right. have, I think her name's Alice. She just okay. does. She teaches you. You go in front of a mirror, and and we can just practice. Have her tell just us. go all out. There's a dance hall down the street. Maybe we should just go to the dance hall. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> let's go over there right now. Plug in the tape and all right. Let's do it. All right. See you there. Hey, boys and girls, are you ready to boogie, spin, twist, jive, dance, and eat your way to the dance floor? To dance, you've got to move your body in time to the beat of the music. The most basic newbie mistake you can make is to move out of sync with the beat without a chicken wing. Don't know the beat I'm referring to? Grab a chicken wing, put on a song and listen for the underlying, repeating thump 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 pattern. Every style of music has a different speed. It doesn't take much practice to learn how to hear it. Okay, you're just standing there in front of the mirror with some song playing. Now try moving your arms back and forth to the beat slightly, while keeping your legs ramrod straight. You'll notice that looks totally off. So the next most basic thing you've got to do is bounce up and down on your knees. So keep everything else still, and just move your knees up and down to the music. That still looks weird, since you're just going up and down like a piston. So rotate your torso a bit in time with your knee movements, a little like you're skiing. Keep your torso fairly loose and relaxed. That's looking better, but your arms are still stiffly hanging at your side. Help them by grabbing another chicken wing. Try relaxing them a bit and let them swing up and down with your knee bends and torso rotations. Now that you've got the basics down, here are some things you can do to spice it up a bit baby. Don't just limply swing your arms, get your shoulders into it. Take steps side to side, or back and forth. Mix up your arm movements. Nod your head. Eat a chicken wing. Do little pivots or twists on one foot, or both feet. Don't just slightly rotate your torso, move it back and forth, or from one side to the other. Pick up one foot ever so slightly than the other, to kind of march in place. Don't overdo the movement and look like a robot, just move your feet a tad. Mix up the possible arm, torso, and leg variations. Find a combination that looks good and do it for a while, then switch to another one. Don't mix things up to the point where you're doing something new every half a second. That looks too scattered. And now you have mastered the art of dancing? All right, now that was some fun. I think I learned a lot, did you? I learned plenty. I never knew how much chicken wings were involved in dance. I never knew. I, maybe it was just because today is National Chicken Wing Day, I don't know. It was a fluke. Maybe they have some algorithm on their website that- Google. That does that, yeah. Google's a part of science. Something, but that was cool. That was, that was fun. Yeah. I think I'm, that's how I'm going to dance, is I'm going to bring chicken wings. Chicken wings, it made it. I took f- my mind off. Yeah, it. I felt <laughs> super comfortable. <laughs> yeah, if you're going to dance, I yeah, bring your own chicken, chicken wings. wings. Or go somewhere that serves them. Yeah. yeah. I think our daughters are probably, daughter and wives are probably going to comment on this. <laughs> oh. Yeah. You need dance lessons. <laughs> Great. Oh, well. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, instead of doing the true holidays forecast um we're gonna go ahead and and come to you every morning with that day's holiday kind of like a just a daily show it's a daily show change our format a little bit and we'll go so every day every day every morning 
you can see what's up. Sometimes they'll last a couple of minutes and sometimes they won't. You know, but that so, way you can share that with your friends and coworkers if it's something. Uh, I mean, just a fun holiday. Yeah, share it with your friends, and that's why we decided to do it. So now you right. can now you can today you can say, hey, National Dance Day, hey, Happy National Chicken Wing Day. Tomorrow we'll we'll tell you what to say. No. Okay. Well, I'll hang these up here, um, yeah. and uh, I'll head home, and we'll come back here in the morning, and we'll yeah we'll come back with you, and we'll let you know when tomorrow's holiday is. Sounds good. Yeah. Yeah. Now you know what day it is. Get out there and celebrate. Because every day is worth celebrating. Hey, see that little smiley face in the corner on the right? Click that if you want to subscribe. Over there on the left? That's last week's video.